Hello. So last time we were able to get the Fairlight up and running, but we weren't able to communicate with it. So let's build a serial cable. Okay, so um, what I need to do now, as I said, is I need to actually make a serial cable that can interface to the CMI. So having a look at the comms area of the CMI, um, it seems the first three pins on the second connector on the 133 board are the main ones for um, serial communications. So what I should be able to do is reverse these two on the CMI end to create a null modem. Um, that just means the transmit goes to the receive, the receive goes to the transmit. Um, I think these are more traditional. So we've got clear to send, um, carrier detect if I remember correctly, and return to send or something. Um, can't remember exactly. And, th and this looks like um, some kind of uh, differential. Um, I'm not sure. That, that definitely looks like, if we've got a plus and minus, it looks like potentially we're using a differential signal on those ones. I've checked these little gates and they're rated for 10 volts. 10 volts is the standard for, roughly the standard for uh, serial communications. So we should be good. So the pins we need to watch out for are the black, the green and the yellow. So if I remember this correctly, that's receive, that's transmit, that's ground. So I just need to reverse these two on the CMI end, which means on the CMI end, we've got ground, receive, transmit. So pin two should go to three and pin three should go to two. So it should go yellow, green, black. So while it's nice to have uh, signals going in both directions, in reality, I really only need the ground and the transmit from the computer to go to the receiver of the Fairlight and I should be able to control it. So the reverse of that one is this should be green. All right. So if I've got that right, um, I should now be able to communicate with the CMI. All right, um, so let's have a look here. So, we've got the 133 card there. I'm coming in there. That's the control panel. That looks like a serial cable. Um, it's got a lot more, <laughs> a lot more going on than that one. Um, Let's try that port. Oi! Yes! Um, page four, I guess. What? Page four. Hey! Page one. Aha! Okay.
So time to get the circuit boards off the kitchen table and put them in a bit of an enclosure. So unfortunately I lost the video at this point, but as you can see, I'm using a comms case as a temporary home for the Fairlight. So that's all for this episode. Next time, I get uptight about things that don't matter. Can I get that anymore in the middle? I get uptight about things that do. Now if I get this wrong, pop. And I try and make myself go deaf. As always, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.